Okay, so if we move away from uh, major heat sources and we start talking about pressure sources, let's look at um, burial metamorphism. So burial metamorphism is one that is low, that is um, characterized by low heat and generally low pressure. The pressure that um, creates rocks in this area is confining pressure. So confining pressure, as I mentioned, is defined by having all axes experiencing the same amount of pressure. And this happens in a burial situation. So here we can see in this diagram we have lots of different strata that over time has been deposited right on the coast of this ocean bed. We've got the um, continental plate that's over to the left in the green and then the ocean is shown in blue. And you can see all of those layers that are um, present and at the bottom you can see where it says high confining pressure and it's increasing confining pressure as we go down. Now this should make sense that the further we go down in earth the more weight there is above it and the more weight there is above it the more pressure is exerted on all sides of a rock unit. So when that happens we actually have the rock lose volume because all of the void spaces in it are um, decreased, are closed. So any air that's left in the rock or water that's left in the rock is squeezed out by this confining pressure. As that happens, we end up with a smaller, less volume rock, and we also get minerals that are very tightly packed together.